I just found one of the hottest deals right now for the Pokemon TCG, and that's right guys, Sam's Club has some new Pokemon product out. Let's see what's inside. It's a lot of packs and a great price. What's going on Funhouse crew? Welcome back to the channel. TCG Funhouse, where we talk all things Pokemon TCG, and yes, on occasions, we do some unboxings, and that is what we are doing today, because I found a fantastic deal on Pokemon TCG cards at your local Sam's Club. That's right, everybody knows that Sam's Club just had literally the worst sale in history when they were offering one single collection box and six reverse rares for $24.99, so they were overcharging by $5.00. For $19.99 box, and all you got was three extra, or sorry, six extra reverse hollows. Um, so they came back with a vengeance today, guys, with their new product. And for $29.99, here it is. You get the $24.99 MSRP Zation box, and then the $19.99 uh, Cinderace tin as well. So you're getting $45 worth of product here for $29.99. I think it's a total of nine booster packs inside uh, with the Zacian V or Zamazenta. There's also Zamazenta ones, and it did mix up the other boxes as well. There was Rillaboom and Cin uh, Cinderace and Inteleon um, as options for that as well. I ended up with two Cinderace uh, tens and uh, what is this? I got a Zacian tin, and uh, yeah, and there's the Zamazenta tin. So we're going to be opening up both of these today. Total of 18 booster packs. We're going to see what packs come inside. Um, I'm hoping they are the older sets because I do believe that this product came out. Um, I believe this product came out uh, during Sword and Shield Base. And I do believe this one came out during Rebel Clash. Um, if that's wrong, let me know in the comment section. Uh, but I'm pretty sure that's when they did come out. So it would be really cool. Uh, to see some Sword and Shield base, some Rebel Clash, maybe even some of the older Sun and Moon sets if they were uh, in the tens back then. I think there was a good opportunity to get like a uh, something like a Guardians Rising, uh, Crimson Invasion, Sun and Moon base, something like that. It would be nice to see those out and about. This is what the box looks like. Breaks it all down in the back. Really good product. Sam's Club, great job for uh, digging yourself out of that little hole you dug into uh, the first time. So let's go ahead and rip into the Cinderace 10 first and see what kind of pack selection we have inside and uh, pull out our beautiful Cinderace V promo card. Ugh. All right, there's the 10, guys. And Oh, no. <laughs> so they have different packs. All right. So here is the card for the Cinderace V promo. Um, just your typical Cinderace. I think this is under a dollar. I think this is like a 75 cent card right now for the Cinderace V, but that's okay. And it, it, they do have newer... Oh, they got okay, they got Evolving Skies. So that's not too bad to get an Evolving Skies. Two Fusion Strike, Chilling Rain, and Evolving Skies. I actually like Fusion Strike. I know a lot of you guys are poo-pooing on Fusion Strike. But uh, I actually like it. I think it's a good set. I think it's underrated. Gengar, Mew, and Espeon all carry pretty decent value, in my opinion. So I think it's going to be a more sought-after set at the end of the day. But let's start ripping some packs, guys, and see if we can get some alternate arts. Cool thing about this, um, this product right now, well, as of right now, we'll see what's in the other 10. But um, everything has a chance for an alternate art. So Fusion Strike, Evolving Skies, and Chilling Rain. I'll have alternate arts and sides, so we are alternate heart hunting on these packs right here. Let's see what we can get. Fusion Strike style, Toxel, Totodile, Tynamo Reverse, and the Deoxys Hollow. Okay, that's not a bad hollow, actually. If you're going to get a hollow, um, the Deoxys is a good one to get because it is uh, a beautiful card. It's Fusion Strike, Single Strike, and Rapid Strike all at once, so I think it's a very unique card. The only card that has all three symbols on them. Actually, I think it's the only card that has multiple symbols, let alone all three. So that's that's pretty cool. Fusion Strike Pack, number two here, guys. Uh, I would love to get the Gengar. I still have not pulled the Gengar yet. I have the Mew. I have the Espeon. I do not have that Gengar alternate art, so that would be my chase for this pack. Dreadnought and the Meloetta. Um... You know, okay, okay. I'll, I'll take it. Of course, you guys know we got to do that evolving skies last because we want that Umbreon baby, that 300 dollars Umbreon still 
going nutsos on the price evaluation. Absolutely insane. Chilling Rain. Uh, a lot of you guys think Chilling Rain is actually an underrated set, undervalued set in its own. I would love that Moltres have not pulled that either. So, dear lean. Oh, yeah, baby. Farfetch, where's my leaks? Leak fans and the Malamar. Okay, so we're, we're not starting off too strong, Sam's Club. We're not starting off too strong. But uh, just for just price per pack, this is not a bad deal. Um, if you got to go by retail, Sam's Club is not bad. Nine packs for $29.99. And uh, we'll see what comes inside that Zacian tin here and see if we can uh, get our monies back out of it. So this is a total of 60 bucks here um, that we're going to be opening today. And, we, you know, hey, we actually saved $30 on, on the total value. Normally it'd be 90 if you bought all these. Hey, Pikachu reverse. Not too bad, but I must say we're starting off a little uh, a little not so good. But, uh, all right, let's, let's open this Zacian. Zacian. 10 and see what's inside this bad boy. This is one of the bigger ones that has five packs. And I see Fusion Strike again right off the bat. Let's check the pack selection here. Cool 10s. I'm not a proponent of uh, keeping stuff in your 10s. Um, I just don't think... Okay, so it's the exact same packs. Two Fusion Strike, one Evolving Skies, and two Chilling Rain. So for every Sam's Club uh, box that you buy, you end up with four Fusion Strike, two Evolving Skies, and three Chilling Rain. Which is not terrible. Um, which is not terrible. There is that Zacian V right there, the promo card. Uh, we're putting our hits up here, where, which, uh, you know, right now is uh, only some Black Star promos. <laughs> Hopefully, we can start adding stuff to the mix um, up in that corner, because right now the really right that opened really strange right there. Really strangely opened a booster pack code card. Fusion Strike. Let me know if you guys get to claim those, if you enjoy um, me giving those back out. It's been a while. Um, yeah, whatever. You guys can use them. No big deal. Gumi. Arakuda, I don't really play anymore online, so uh, we, we open them. You know, for Alligator Reverse Rare and the Swampert Hollow. All right, so we're two hollows so far. Uh, we do open them. I let my kids open them. Um, very easy open packs, man. Very easy open. Almost like they're just like this, you know, 900 print run. Just, just get them out. Um, my boys open packs online, you know, because it's, you know, it's significantly, it's basically free um, instead of having to keep buying packs over and over and over again. So, uh, good fun fact for kids. If they love Pokemon TCG and you can't keep affording to buy pack after pack after pack, use those code cards, man. They, they get just as much enjoyment online. There we go. Chandelure V. My favorite Pokemon, if you guys are friends of the channel, you know Chandelure is my dog. I love me some Chandelure V. Glad he got some love in Fusion Strike. Would love to pull the rainbow card. Um, but yeah, guys, Chandelure V inside. Oh, man, I should probably sleeve up my Black Star promos too, man. You gotta you gotta sleeve up all V cards. You know, you gotta show them the love. But um, using the Dragon Shield sleeves here, guys. Beautiful Dragon Shield sleeves. If you want the best sleeves on the market, which are Dragon Shield, make sure you guys, in the description below, there's an affiliate link. Go buy them with my affiliate link. You get the best cards or the best sleeves on the market, and I get a nice little kickback as well. It goes directly to their site. Fantastic company, fantastic sleeves. And if you enjoy customizable sleeves, there's also a link for yourplaymat.com down there where you can customize your own sleeves and playmats. So if you want to troll your opponents at your local LGS with a big play mat of your face or big sleeves of your face on them, you absolutely can. Using TCG Funhouse 10 YP in the checkout gives you 10% off your first order at yourplaymat.com. And that's like literally the best troll, man. Oh, coffee, and I lost all my cards. What's happening? I'm a professional, I swear. Um, I just, you know, I, I, did, I just wanted to get to it. I knew there was, I knew... There is nothing there, and I just want to get to it. Um, not because I'm clumsy whatsoever. But uh, get out of here, Code Cod. All right, guys, we got that Evolving Skies after this. We're going to need something from that Evolving Skies. We're going to need an Umbreon, a Glaceon, you know, some form of Evolution alternate art tonight. I am feeling it. It's coming. Sobble, Ladybug, Squalbot. So sick of Squalbot. And the sauce book. Okay, guys, these uh, this might be a disclaimer telling you that if you like opening packs, there go get these. If you want pulls, do not. <laughs> Let's go, guys. We got a Chandelure V. 
Um, without a doubt, this is still a fantastic deal on Pokemon cards. This one feels a little more sealed, so hopefully there's an actual hit in here. Uh, we have one more box that we're going to be getting to, guys. So um, I bought two of them. Actually, do I have another one? I think I bought three, and I got one sitting over there. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. I might give it away on the live stream, uh, depending on how these pull rates go. Um, but I do think I bought three. I mean, this was like a week and a half ago. Who expects me to remember that much? Petlil, C dot reverse, and the Gorgeist. Okay. Okay, guys. I'm not sounding the alarm just yet because we have one more box. I'm not sounding the alarm just yet, but I'm getting worried that there might not be anything in here. Let me give it a hug. Okay. Just filled it full of luck. That's all I did there. Nothing weird. I swear. YouTube algorithm, yeah, monetization, don't worry, that was not weird. Um, I do that all the time. No concerns here. Another Cinderace V10. Oops. <laughs> we used to have the trash corner here on the channel when we used to do unboxings a long time ago, and uh, that sound of that definitely, definitely makes me think of that trash corner. We used to fill that sucker up all the way to the top. And it's the same packs inside, guys, as expected. Fusion Strike, Evolving Skies, and Chilling Run. Cinderace V, right there, of course, inside the shield. Uh, you know, because i got to protect my 60 cent investment in case there's no pulls in here, for sure. Um, okay, so, Fusion Strike. Come on, guys. I keep telling you guys, I keep saying Fusion Strike is underrated. I need to put my money where my mouth is here at this point um, because it's not looking very good, <laughs> unfortunately. So let's make this happen. All right, let's go. Fusion Strike action. We need some of that Gengar, the SP on that Mew, guys. Ooh. I would have liked to seen some uh, Brilliant Stars in here. That would have been cool. These were probably packed before then. Beautiful Ninetales artwork. Um, should be a holographic rare, in my opinions. Ninetales getting uncommon. Completely disrespectful. Completely disrespectful for Ninetales. They need to step that up. Totodile, Charge Bug Reverse, and the Acelgore. And I am two seconds from crying. I am two... You're about to see a grown-ass man cry here on YouTube. Um, probably just for the likes, you know. People bully me enough and I'll cry for the likes. I'll, you know, I don't care. I'm a sellout. Just kidding. But I will. Code Cod! Right there, Fusion Struck. Okay, this is it, guys. This is the pack right here. Schoolboy bringing some luck. Schoolboy bringing some luck. Primate, Zerud, Mythical Pokemons as Uncommons always frustrates me. Why? Why, why, why? Makes no sense. At least make it a holographic. Aracuda, and I'm going to uh, and Cloyster. Temper Tantrum as well. Tears and Temper Tantrum incoming, guys. 60 bucks here. 60 bucks worth of stuff at your retailers. Sam's Club. Let's see. Come on. 18 total packs. 18 total packs. And we've got one pull so far. It is time to get some more action going on. Pokemon, I know you turned up your printing, but did you forget to turn on the ultra rare side of the machine? Crustal and the Volcarona V full art. That is a beauty right there. Look how beautiful that card is. Absolutely stunning artwork with the blue and the red background. This will look fantastic in one of these red sleeves. That's another good thing about the uh, the Dragon Shield is they have so many different color options. They have, uh, I think, over 20 different color options for you over there, plus a ton of brushed art sleeves. Very, very beautiful. Very, very beautiful. And uh, if you buy into my stream, you guys get to experience the Dragon Shield sleeves for yourselves because I always ship inside the Dragon Shields um, plus uh, top loaders for protection. So, all right. Drizzle, but not the one that I want. I want the other Drizzle that I can sell for like six bucks. Hatena, Rockruff, Shuppet, Cast Form. Let's go! <laughs> All right. Last box, guys. Zamazenta. We need the Zamazenta here to come into the clutch. Do you guys ever get cards from uh, Sam's? So um, I am a Sam's Club official member. I mean, I'm just saying. I mean, anybody can be if you buy in. But I'm an official member of the Sam's Club. Me and Sam go way back. Um, but do you guys also go to Costco? I've seen a lot of people get a lot of good deals at Costco. Um, which one do you prefer? Are the deals better at Costco or are the deals better at Sam's? 
I've always wondered because I've never gone to Costco myself, but I have seen people uh, get some really good and spicy deals at the Costco. All right, two fusion strike, evolving skies, and chilling rain. You guys know how we do that. Evolving skies pack has to be last because there just has to be a Rayquaza in there. That's that's the one I'm gunning for. Don't get me wrong, I'll take the Umbreon. I already have one though. I've actually pulled it twice. I pulled it for myself. Um, and then I also pulled it for somebody on our live streams. That's right, a $300 hit on the live streams, guys. Tremendous luck over there. Like, we've had so much freaking luck. It's insane. Phalanx, Maractus, Galarian, Obstagoon, Holographic. It seems like every single pack, the every single box, the first pack had, like, a hollow in it. Um, but yeah, guys, we're still sitting on two hits for 18 packs. This is, this is not looking pretty. We got four more opportunities here. Four more opportunities. Fusion strike action. I think we got something. There was a little peeker sneaker McGeeker over there. Terminator. Piyukamuku. Yes, I just said Terminator. I just realized I just said that now. Don't at me, bro. Chansey. Zigzagoon. Gossiflower reverse. And the Mew full art. Okay. Now we're into some beautiful territory. And to show you other colors, they have gold as well. Beautiful gold right there. Not sure if red would match. Gold doesn't really match either. It looks fantastic on the gold cards, though. Like, look at this right here. Here's the uh, gold Calyrex from Astral. Look how beautiful that gold looks on that gold card. Um, but, yeah, guys, Mew Full Art. Finally something in here. Beautiful hit right there. That's a nice, nice card. Mew. I got two Full Arts. Okay, so that's two Full Arts out of these. Not too shabby. Um, I guess... Two, both of those came out of the one uh, box, though. So we've had one good box and one really, really bad box. RNG, man. Pokemon loves to torture people, but then they also love to reward them unexpectedly as well with massive hits. It's it's crazy the way it is. Like, it's either hot or dry. Hot or dry? It's either hot and dry or wet and spicy. Mm, girl, no, you didn't. Um... But it's always one or the other, man. You're either in a drought or you're just getting banger after banger. Um, sadly, I've been in a drought lately. Um, but that's because Astral Radiance treated me so well in the very beginning when it came out. I was just getting hit after hit after hit after hit. And now Pokemon's like, all right, we got to bring it down a little notch here. Got to bring it down. You got to share some love for others. Um, Fog Crystal. So hopefully you guys are getting some of those bangers that I have not been getting lately. Um... Because it's, it's been rough. It's been, it's been rough. Mareep. Corbominable. Full art and the Frostlass holographic. But I can't I can't lie, man. That Mew V full art is a, a wonderful card. Um, about a $30 price tag, I think, if I remember correctly. Um, I haven't looked up that card in a while. I have pulled it before. And I want to say it was around 30 bucks last time, a few weeks ago. Um, if it has changed, let me know. But pretty much half of my value inside that one card right there. So... It's actually, that put us pretty decently close. And let's see if this Evolving Skies can put us over our limit here, guys. Carvana, Emolga, Slackoth, Gossiflower, Lucky Ice Pop, and the Regilecki Holographic. So, overall, guys, it wasn't too terrible at the end of the day. It took a while for us to actually get some hits. Really slow moving right there. But we ended up with the Volcarona and Mew full art V cards. One from Evolving Skies and one from Fusion Strike. Chandelure V, and then of course the, fro the four promo cards that come inside the box. So three ultra rare or better hits out of 18 packs. Really, really low pull rates, but when you add the four promo cards in there, you're really looking at like seven. Um, so it's not too shabby. We did get quite a few holographic rares as well, uh, including that Regilecki on top. So overall, not too bad. If you're a pack ripper and you want to open a bunch of packs of different sets and you don't want to just go buy a booster box, this is not a bad product for you to buy at all. So head over to your Sam's Club, get yourself some uh, some sweet, sweet Fusion Strike Evolving Skies and Chilling Rain booster packs at a pretty decent price. But that's the opening today, guys. Let me know down in the comment section, was it a good value? Nine booster packs. Two tens, $29.99, a MSRP savings of about $15, plus 
Pull rates were a little weak, I'm not going to lie, but overall it was a fun experience. I give it a thumbs up. If you can find some of these at your Sam's, grab a couple of them. They're fun to open. Open them with the kids, open them with the family, and it's just, it's, it's a crazy, crazy good time. If you're new to the channel, guys, drop a sub. We post Pokemon related content every single day here on the channel in three to four full length videos as well. So hit that like button. It really, really helps out because every time you do, somebody out there comes from behind and wins a Pokemon TCG tournament like Ash took eight years to do. Just saying. Just saying, guys. Just saying. But I really appreciate you guys spending some time with me today, and I hope you all have a wonderful night.